Welcome my guys to another video, this is Charlie here and today we're here playing Alien Isolation. This is going to be part one and I did play this game a few years back. I will be completely honest with you and the series is still up with my channel. The only thing was that was back in 2018 I believe and those videos are rather cringy. These videos are kind of cringy. Stupid schmuck. I didn't beat the entire game though, I believe I played about the first two maybe three hours and just kind of stopped there I don't know why but I did but anyways here we are I'm hoping we're not gonna start from where I left off we're just gonna start off from the start because I can't remember anything about this game pretty much so you know what we're gonna jump straight into a new game okay so here we go alien isolation yes thank you very much now I remember the first episode or like the first like 30 minutes to this game it's a bit slow and it kind of introduces you to like the, the entire game so you kind of just have to get introduced to this character this world and from there on it just gets better and you know freaking better anyways here we are hello Ooh. okay please sign in sure thing with water okay I can walk it's probably a good thing because if I couldn't walk that would be fairly worrying E to sign in so then oh, I remember all of these oh that's so cool okay Okay, objective updated. Explore the torrents. Oh, it's the music as well, man. It's the freaking music and all that jazz, you know? So our current objective is to, of course, get dressed. I should probably do so. It's a real good thing that the webcam stops there. Because you see, I'm not wearing any pants. Yeah. <laughs> I'll leave you up to decide whether you believe that. Uh, save game. Now, I don't believe we're alone on the ship. At least I hope we're not alone, because that would be bad. What would it? I don't know. I think you'd go a little bit crazy, a bit like lockdown. I will admit it, I'm pretty sure most people, including myself, went a little bit crazy over being in quarantine constantly. But uh, here we are. Still alive and well, I hope. Uh, hello? Oh, there they are, people. I see people. Okay, we're gonna go see hello to the people inside the ship. Hello. Ah, Ripley. Samuels, did you wake up early? Well, I don't really need as much sleep as the rest of you. I was just inspecting the Torrens facilities, a well-maintained ship. I realize it's a very similar model to... The Nostromo. Yes, M-Class. A later pattern, but close in spec. I've worked engineering jobs on ships like this. Of course. Is Taylor up yet? She's not a seasoned traveler. Hypersleep may have been punishing for her. Haven't seen her. I'll go check on her. Okay, right, so we're gonna go. S okay, so we've just spoken to Samuels and now we've got to go speak to Taylor. Oh, that was me hitting the chair. Oopsie. <laughs> right, so we're gonna go find Taylor, uh, wherever she is. I don't know. Man, I really like. See, I like the first two alien films and I thought Prometheus was good and uh, Alien. Alien Conveyant was also good. Alien 3 and I believe it's Alien Resurrection. Eh, you know. Hello, who are you? Ah, uh, I'm surely I do. Okay, let me collect my briefing doc out of my way. <laughs> Thank you. I've got my briefing file. Whoa. Can we see it? Switch to monitors. Sevastopol Station. Is that damage? It looks like damage. Punch up 74, tight angle. Looks like the dry dock bay is screwed. I can't bring the Torrens into that. This is a commercial vessel Torrens out of St. Clair, registration number MSV7760, calling Sevastopol Traffic Control. We're carrying three passengers on a whale and Utani Bond. You're holding the Nostromo flight recorder unit. We request immediate permission to transfer the passengers port side over. Hello, Marshal? Mar Marshal, this is the Torrens. Say again? All I saw was serious situation, and you already know that there's aliens on that ship, so... Ay ay ay. Ay ay ay. Mmm. The station's comms seem pretty screwed up, so I fitted Samuel's suit with a radio booster. I can only keep the Torrens in transit for 24 hours. You'll have heard from us by then. 
safe trip. Damn, this is gonna be sick. Okay, please tell me we get to like, you know, we get to take control of the character as they jump onto the ship. Because that would be kind of sick, you know? This game still looks amazing, especially since it came out in like 2014. Just shadow me, Taylor. You too, Samuels. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. Ooh. Look at that. That's not even like a small jump. That's like a look at that massive walk bay as well. Fuck happened here. My god, Ripley. You're doing good, Taylor. <laughs> Oh, not a King Asgard's first thought, is it? Taylor Ripley, hold on. Oh dear, that's really not gonna... That's one, one's making it. Is that Ripley? I think that's Ripley, okay. Samuel! Taylor, respond, anybody! Well, they just, you know, they just killed those two off like that, I assume. I can't remember. I think they're dead, though. I don't know. You can't take my word for it, but... Jesus, man. Off with a bang, shall we say. We're now aboard... Oh, aboard. Aboard. Not aboard. We're now aboard this mighty ship right here, and... As they said earlier, there's a serious situation going on. Which is, uh, probably not a good thing for us now boarding the ship. You can already hear the alarms. Like, you hear alarm sounds? Not a good sign, mate. You should probably head off. Rather than making your entrance onto it. Okay, which way do we go? Okay, this way. Okay, nice, nice. We change. And we've got to try and find help, which I guess is kind of like, you know, the obvious. Can you see this route? Oh. Okay. Right, use registration points to save your. Yeah, I already know about saving your progress, okay? So we're kind of left to just kind of explore the ship at our own... ...pace, you know? Oh, I forgot we can run. Obviously we can run. Okay, right. Can we go this way at all? Oh, no. Can't go that way then. All right. Never mind. Uh, this way looks accessible-ish. Oh, no. It's just looped us round. Oh! <gasps> Oh, there's a vent here. It looks like a butthole, though. Can I climb through? <laughs> I can't. No. All right. Anyways, it. Oh, we can. Never mind. I really like. I remember these vent ways being amazing. Okay. Right. Okay. It's all fun and games until, of course, the alien decides to come and join you down in one of these lovely vents right here. Then it becomes a slight concern. You know. Anyways, nice and easy. We just go through like that. This whole place is falling apart. So we might want to be fairly, fairly hasty on our departure here. Okay, so crawl across that. Crawl across! Gods! Okay. Mm. Was that like a big fall? Oh, that looks like a big fall. I'm not sure if we're going to be able to just easily, you know, like climb back up. I doubt it. We have got some flares here, though. So that, I is assume, that... is going to help us light. Okay, so it's Z. Okay, so Z. You get the flare out. And then mouse. Oh. Okay, this looks really cool. Go through here. Hello. <laughs> Awfully smoky down here. Don't suppose there's any aliens lurking down here, either. Hmm? Yeah, let's press that. I think we have to climb up the ladder, so this would be most helpful. And this we can go through here. No, there's nothing down there. Okay, there's nothing down there. Then I presume the only course of action is to indeed climb up this incredibly long ladder. Ah, that is blinding. Okay, what's this? Scrap. Okay, lovely song. <laughs> Hello. Ooh. 
looks much bigger. It's like a little model of the ship. Now, I'm not sure exactly where we are on that ship, but uh, we are somewhere on that ship. If that does indeed help you out. Okay. Tomorrow, no together, no future. Uh-oh. Definitely seems like things have gone downhill very quickly. Haven't seen a single human being here. Right. I'll do. Some lovely tapping ASMR for all of you folks. Okay. There you go, that's done. You can access this terminal. Mm -hmm. Okay, there we go. So we've restored the power within this place. So obviously all the lights. Oh, hang on, there's people. Hang on, let's go that way. Let's go. Ooh. This place is open as well. Ah, okay, so many routes, so many different places to choose from. I'm going to go this way. I'm not sure if this is a good idea or not, though. Okay, all right. Mm. Mm. Don't like this. There's too many sounds, you know? Too many sounds going on at the same time. Ah, okay, this looks like some sort of, like, you know, shopping mall of sorts. On of the spaceship. Yet again, no one's here. We've seen two people, but they were running in the opposite direction. <gasps> the yeah, that must be the ship that we landed on. Okay. I'm here. I'm right here. We're lame. Mate, they're not going to hear you. <laughs> they're literally outside in space. I'm not sure you're being the most clever. Oh, and there. There we go. Yeah, just my luck. Just my luck. Need some power for that room just there. So, I presume, one would assume, you go this way. Right, there's some sort of power thing here. So, yet again, some more ear ASMR for you lot. There you go, and uh, there you go. Uh -huh, uh -huh. One more time. There we go. You're welcome. Honestly, I know you guys love it. So don't even tell me like you don't love the ear ASMR. Because I know you're lying. Okay, underneath here. And this door. Has opened up. Hello? We go down here. Oh, we do. Okay, right. So we just... You just climb into vents at your own convenience. I'm not sure how I feel about that, that, because I don't like, you know, like, having to go down into the vents. It's nice and claustrophobic. And there's problems like that when there's something clearly in front of you that was just here, but is no longer here. Okay. We might want to be a little bit more cautious now. Don't know what's lurking about. Can I, like, move this? We can. There we go. Okay. Some scrap. Nice. Always love a bit of scrap, don't we? Hear the sounds. Okay. Now, I know this is like a slightly longer playthrough. About 20 hours or something ridiculous like that. So I'm pretty sure I'm going to keep these episodes like, you know, like longer and less edits. You guys seem to like that as well, so... Oh, hello? Someone went across there. I'm going to follow them. Huh? Where did they go? They went this way. I saw them go this way. Okay. I don't know where they've gone. They could have gone in there. It needs a plasma torch. I don't know where we're going to be getting a plasma torch from, kind sir. But if we do find one... It's going to be the exit up ahead. Ah. Maintenance jack required as well. Aye, aye, aye. So many different things we have to get. Okay, so looters will pay. Ah. Well, that just doesn't seem like a very friendly message being sent around now, does it? No, that door seems nice and open. Let's go ahead and check inside here first. You know, just... I, I have severe flashbacks from the bad circumstances of wandering underneath a vent when you probably shouldn't have. Let's get some power up in this bitch, though. So here we go. Now that the energy's back up, though, we might be able to access this, ro this room up there. The lights certainly seem on now. So that's probably a good thing. F the marshals. I'm not sure what I am. Hopefully I'm not a marshal. I don't know. I'm not exactly getting a loving vibe here, am I? No. Oh, what's this? Reverse, it's Turner. Got to deal with that wasted asshole again. This time he nearly wrecked the door with a maintenance jack. Guess he figures it's safe here. Wants to lock himself in. Screw him. We got 
too much to worry about without babysitting drunks. Anyway, I threw him in the evidence lockup. Let the son of a bitch sleep it off. Alright, so maintenance lockup. Okay. Ah. Uh, now that's bloods, and that looks fairly recent. Is that saliva? No, that's water. Okay. Yeah, thank God that's water <laughs> and not saliva. Because if it's saliva, then you already know what it is. And that's probably bad. Uh, speaking of which. I think that's what we need, though. We need that maintenance hammer, so we need to get in here somehow. There's a vent. Okay, we're going to get inside the vent. I think this is going to lead us straight to that hammer, which is good. That's what we want. Ish. We just don't know how recent those uh, that murder is. Was it a person or was it an alien? Ah. Uh, now, as we slowly head towards the entrance of this vent, there seems to be a surprisingly more or increasing amount of muck in the way. Hello? Okay, I'm assuming this is the guy that he locked away. We can get his ID tag. And we can also get his maintenance jack. So, uh, I, I'll just, yeah, yeah, I'll just, yeah, I'll just be taking this. Yeah, thanks. Yeah. I think I need this more than you do. I agree. I think I do need this more than you do. Alright, so. I'm gonna go now. Alright, I'm just, I'm gonna go. Okay, alright, so all we need for this. X and left mouse. Oh, oh. Hey, there you go. I was like, why does it take free controls? Why can it not just be left mouse button? You know? You know? I don't know. Well, I'm going to go ahead and have a little look here around all of these rooms which had this on. And obviously we can try and get to some sort of conclusion about what was in these rooms. But yeah, I'll cut you in a bit. Now, it seems the only other place we can go or use this maintenance jack thing for is for this brace here. And it's a cutscene. Okay. Okay. Ooh. Turn around. Come on! I'm Ripley. Where'd you come from? Ripley? Off station. A ship. There's no ships here! There are now. Well, <laughs> that's good news. Because things are not so good here. Something blue just now. Rocked this whole place. I saw it. But lady, that's the least of our problems. Yeah? Yeah. Something's on this station. Something you wouldn't believe. Like what? A killer. You get it? Okay. Okay. What's your name? Axel. Excellent. Okay. I was boarding with two colleagues. EVA. We got separated by the blast. Can you help me find them? Why? Because you seem to know your way around. No, I mean, why? What's in it for me? A place on the ship. That's a good deal. I know I can trust you. I need to find comms. I need to contact my ship. He made some allies already. This is a shame he's a bit of a nutcase. <laughs> Seek okay. some comms is in the Sistex bar. It's quite a distance, but we can get to transit through the freight area. But watch well. yourself. We can get into all sorts of trouble there. Okay. okay, well, we're gonna unlock this brace and we're gonna head inside. Alright, so if that's alright with you, Axel. Okay, and I assume is we're just gonna explore. Me back there? I had to keep my distance. Can't take any chances. That's true. You don't know what the people are like living around here, eh? Inquisitive type, eh? Stick close to me. Okay. What? Okay. <gasps> hey, don't move. Oh. Uh, okay. Okay. We're not looking for trouble. Who are you? I'm John. This is Ringo. They're just some assholes. Already lied. We haven't got time for this. Oh, you already Jen. lied. Okay. We're trying to get to comms. Can you help us? We don't need their help. Don't tell them anything. Look. I've got the elevator working. Jana, let's go, okay? I... I'm sorry. Good luck. Uh, everyone's just working for themselves here. Which kind of makes sense. You stick with who you trust. What the damn. hell was that about? Why are you so damn aggressive? Everyone's running shit scared. Keeping to their own. Safer that way. Damn straight. Ooh, what's that mean? I hope this ship of yours is the real McCoy. So do we. It might not even be working anymore because there was a massive bat. 
You know, that's a fair accusation to make, I would admit. Allow me. Place is all. Needs a special touch. <laughs> of course it does. Okay, alright. So there are elevators in this place. Can I do the the button well, pushing? What are you waiting for? They're trying to press the button. Well, that's not creepy. You hear the little ringtone that was just playing there. Yeah, lovely. 